So, there are so many big news. So there's no one big splash because there are many big splashes. Um, we have great advances in studying the genome, myeloma genome. Besides the MGP project, there are many other presentations that is beginning to define the clonal heterogeneity. That's one of the bigger news in this meeting. A uh, lot of uh, information from our own group and others of what may be causing it. So what makes myeloma's genome unstable that leads to progression. And then some efforts in understanding what are the pathways that are perturbed that may make myeloma cell behave the way it does. We had a presentation on how early smoldering myeloma becomes myeloma and what are the changes that, are, that leads from early non-malignant stage to a malignant state. And so that's one of the important news of this meeting to understand the progression of myeloma. On the therapeutic side, there are a lot of new drugs which are the next generation of drugs that are being presented and, and, and discussed. Um, utilization of um, the checkpoint inhibitor is a big news. Um, utilization of um, some of the targeted drugs uh, uh, that are becoming important in the therapy uh, and uh, that's an important advancement here. And then role of transplant is also being discussed. How much it helps? Does the second transplant helps or not? Which is being presented as a late breaking abstract where role of second transplant is limited but it, that may be something to look for. Also role of consolidation treatment how much it helps, where it helps. So these are the general big news for myeloma in this meeting.